Family business is hit by thieves during really what is the most important time of the year. It's called the Clark County Scaregrounds. That's a haunted house in Ridgefield at the fairgrounds property. They had thousands of dollars in tools stolen just weeks before they open. Our Trevor Alt spoke with the owners. He joins us live right now with this crime alert. Well, Dan and Jennifer, good afternoon. We're inside the warehouse that, as we speak, is being transformed into a haunted house. And they have 18 days to get all 20,000 feet ready, and they're doing it with a very minimal crew. And that's what makes this theft hit them so hard. This morning and this afternoon, I spoke extensively with one of the owners, Jason Greeley Roberts, and he told me that on Friday, everything was locked up overnight, but a thief managed to pry open the outside door, then slip inside and steal about $2,500 worth of tools and batteries, and they were his personal tools that he uses year-round to make his living. Now, since then, a number of people stepped up to get them replacement tools, but it still cost them valuable time in getting everything ready, and the financial burden is enormous for a business that's already operating on very thin margins. We don't have the budget that a lot of the big productions in town do, so when we lose our means of producing our product, it really does take a toll. Jason says this isn't the first time this has happened. Two years ago, one of his workers had their tools stolen, and afterwards all the locks were replaced, but the Clark County Event Center, which is where this is located, still doesn't have security cameras, so they don't know who's responsible for this most recent theft. Jason is hoping they'll get cameras moving forward. Now, he tells me on any given day, they only have a handful of workers here. They're probably going to be working to get this ready up until 10 minutes before they open up. That's on October 5th, two weeks from Friday. They are really hurrying to get everything ready on time. Again, that is why this theft is causing such a problem. They're hoping for a big turnout that will make up for that financial burden. Reporting live in Ridgefield, Trevor Alt, COIN 6 News. Oh, I have a good idea they will. We live in such a great community. I'm sure people will show up.